My mom lets me. You can get it. Easier said than done. Things are a total mess at home. Everyone is defiant. Never mind. See you in the evening. Wish me luck. Mother? What is it you need again? Oh, bravo, Mom. Why are you acting like this? My dear beloved mother. Ugh! Don't play me. And before you say another word, you aren't allowed to go anywhere. Come on, Mom! Oof. Ah, uh, what did I tell you, young lady? The answer's no. And I won't repeat myself. <laughs> but it's not like I'm doing anything crazy. I just want to go and hang out with some people and talk a bit. All of my friends are going to be there. Your friends are not my concern. You are. Yeah, Mother, I promise that I won't be late and I'll be safe. I'll be here at the exact minute you want me to be. I promise you, I swear to what you- What did I say, Daphne? Not another word. You will drop this matter and go back to your chores. You! Keep the engine on. Be careful, man. No! 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 Basir, I've checked out the woods. There's not a soul around, man, not one soul. The cottage is also empty. No one has been there for a long time. There is no better place to take this girl to, but the only way to get there is by walking. Fine. Then we will walk. Come on, let's take her out of the car. Come on, stand up. Be still. Don't struggle so much. No one can hear you anyway. Walk. 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 Shut the hell up! Come on, man, take out the gag, she'll suffocate. Take it off, then. We're gonna need her alive. What do you want from me? Why did you kidnap me? Shut the hell up already, huh? Shut your mouth! I don't have to explain myself to you! Don't worry so much. You're not gonna have to be here that long, okay? No, you've messed up. You have bitten off more than you can chew. You know that, right? When my family finds out what you've done to me, they'll destroy you and your family, understand me? We'll see about that. Let's see if that smart uncle of yours and your father can withstand the pressure I'm about to put on them. Who do you think you are? You think you know us? Huh? Are you a part of some mafia? Invading our homes with guns? Kidnapping their family members? Do you think you'll get away with it? Shh, shut up! Enough already! You'll be strung up by your feet, hanging in the town square! Not one more word, or I'll be forced to- What do you be forced to do? Are you gonna kill me, huh? Huh? Listen up! <laughs> Everything depends on your Uncle Eshdare, you hear me? Huh? If they even think about messing with me, I will bring you something worse than death. I will show you no mercy, no mercy for you! Now do you understand? You understand I'm not choking around with you? <laughs> I'll take care of this. You guys get going. Be careful, man. All right? Don't make any mistakes. Okay, okay. Don't worry about me. You also be careful, all right? No one can find us here, okay? Nobody. You got it. You see that, don't you? She's not answering her phone now. 
since I didn't let her have her way like she's used to. She's punishing me with these silly games. I think you're pushing her too far, Safika. She's just young, and she just wanted to have some fun. What's the big deal? This is not your concern. You are a woman without a child. You have no right telling me how to discipline mine. For the love of all things, who knows where she is hanging out right now? She won't answer the phone because she's scared. And she's become so rebellious and so disobedient. Is she letting that city slicker get the best of her? Let her come back here. Let her step back through this door. I know what to do with her. Luckily, Simal hasn't arrived yet. We would also have to answer to him, wouldn't we? <laughs>